Jersey Resale. Follow the hustle. All right, so we're gonna go into the Nike store real quick, but I wanna let you guys know a few things about the Nike store. We're not just going in there and buying anything that can make us a profit. We're not going in there super blind. We don't even know what we're looking for really, but here's the strategy, the way they mark stuff down. First, they mark it down to nine nine. That means the last two numbers in the price are nine nine, red tags. After that, it gets marked down to nine seven. Nine seven is actually the lowest price they'll ever put on a tag, but after they mark it down to a nine seven, they put it down to the additional 30% off. After that, it will go to the back wall where it will live for the rest of its sad, meager life. So the strategy is focus on the nine sevens with the 30% off, then scan the nine sevens. These are all red tags. Then scan the nine nines. After that, anything that catches our eye along with apparel, bags, lunch boxes, any type of stuff that we think might make us money. But that is the order of operations. And we're just going in there, Bluetooth barcode scanner. We got our scouting app on our phone and we are just scanning away, inputting our cost of goods and seeing what kind of profit we can make. After that, throw it in the car, go to the next store, get home, pack it up, send it to Amazon. That's the name of the game. But right now we're gonna head into the Nike store and we're gonna make some money or we're gonna find some stuff that when we sell it, we can make some money. So I don't wanna hear nobody saying that potential profit stuff. Enough talking, let's go into the store. Showing the wrong color associated with this barcode. Yeah. We're not gonna buy it. It could be killer, but we'd have to fix the page because people are gonna buy them and think they're blue. Okay, so let's keep going. Man. If you never bought shoes here before, they're so cheap. Looking at the back of the socks. I'm looking at this bag down here. We already looked at that, I thought. I don't know if we looked very good. Oh no, good. My, no, my scout lead didn't work. Yeah, so this is 40% off from 60, which makes it 36. Sell for 79, profit 20. Sales rank 20,000, average sales rank 30,000. So this is this could be a pretty good buy. Let's see how many stars this has. 907 reviews, four and a half stars. That's a good product. Press the button, just let it go. There you go. Technology, bro. Oh my God. You don't understand. It's already like 80 degrees here, but this mask makes my face at least 20 degrees hotter. And it smells like butt. Maybe that's my breath. Either way, I'm excited. Store one done. I'm sweating like a pig. We're about to go to store number two, and then we're gonna go hit up some Marshalls or Ross or Burlington's. But let me give you a quick breakdown. We didn't get a lot. We spent about 800 bucks two transactions and we only actually got two different styles of shoes. 10 of a really nice neon green running shoe, Zoom Pegasus Turbo 2 that we paid I think like 50 bucks for. Retails for 120 to 180. And then we got some Pegasus 34s that we paid like 35 bucks a piece. And those are gonna be much less profit each, like 15 to $20 profit each, but they're gonna sell really fast. The rank is like 5,000. Also, we learned about the new limits at the Nike store. So the new limits at the Nike factory outlet are per person, you can only get 30 units. You can only get five of each color and style. So not of UPC, but like this shoe in that color, doesn't matter what size it is, you could only get five as opposed to the original 10. So five per color per style, max 30 pieces, max spend 3000. Those are the new limits. But the cool thing is that they're now taking tax exempt, which they didn't all used to take tax exempt. So we just did tax exempt at Nike for the first time, which is pretty amazing. Off to the next one. All right, I think we're good. We are about to head into Nike factory store number two. We spent 800 bucks. We are up 700 of potential profit. Yes, we still have to sell it, but we are now going into store two. Wish us luck. We're gonna do our best to film in the store, but you're not supposed to. So we're gonna use phone footage because we're gonna get in trouble. So wish us luck. 45, normally 130 plus 30% off. Wow, these did not hit. I wonder if it's just a new shoe. It doesn't look terribly ugly to be yeah, like a million it, rank. But why would it be that? Like cheap? Yeah. yeah. Looks like we're making like 20 bucks a There's not a lot of ooh in the house. There's a 
couple here though. It's like wow, just get a it's up when only one size is profitable in the restaurant. That's a very yeah. weak signal. You know what I mean? And then plus it's still not very good. Let's see if I'm this one. Yeah, all of them, but the ten and a half is the most profitable. <laughs> it has the least amount of stock, probably. Yeah. You got your scanner. And the best so well that it looks like I look at it. Dude, there's not a ton of them. Look, 18, 24, 60, double there too. Just the 10s? There's none here, there's none here, on double there, there. 10 right there? Where? None here. Right here. Is that the same shoe? No, it's a new for the 18. Yeah, but there's also like some marks in here. You see it? Wow. So here's the haul from store two. I'm gonna carry this all to the car now through the mall. This is the second stop, Nike Factory Outlet Store. We spent $1,500 at this stop. We got about $700, $800 profit. All in all, we spent $2,200 at two Nike outlet stores and our expected profit, which will sell in hopefully about 30 to 60 days, these are all very fast moving shoes, is 1,500 bucks. So think about that. We spent four hours shopping at two retail stores, maybe a few more hours processing this stuff. I'll make that into another video to show you guys the whole process. $2,200 on the line, we're gonna get that back plus $1,500 profit. It sure beats digging a hole in the ground, you feel me? I do want to point out to you guys that not everybody can sell Nike. Nike is a restricted brand on Amazon. And what that means is that you're gated and you can get ungated in different ways. It's not impossible, you can do it. I made a whole video over here showing you guys exactly how to do it. So click up here to check that video and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. So you just went to the Nikes? <laughs> we just went to the Nike factory store. We spent 800 bucks. We got about 20 pairs of shoes. We're gonna make $700 profit. These are all gonna sell within 30 days on Amazon FBA. Get on that hustle wave, baby. Strangle to death as I mangle your flesh. Lights on, night con, which angle is best? I put you in the frame and let you hang with the rest. Call it photo finish as we diminish your last breath. And if the Sabbath is the day of the Lord, then my style of rap is like the way of the sword. Better sharpen your blade, I'm coming straight for your door. I see the devil in your...